Hey there, I'm Austin with Live Aquaria for this week's What the Fish. Upon arrival of your new item, be it a coral, a fish, or an invert, you're going to want to check the specific gravity of the water. You can do that with any kinds of manual items or even with an electronic one like these. Usually from Live Aquaria, you'll receive your new item at the correct specific gravity, which is 1.025. That's what the ocean is. But from our facility in California, there's a good bet you'll receive it at a lower salinity, which is 1.018, for reasons that we can cover in another video. So let's show you some great ways to properly acclimate your fish to your tank. First off, turn off your aquarium lights, as well as dim the lights to the room you're in. Then you're going to want to float your bag in your tank for about 15 minutes. Here are the two methods that we recommend for acclimation. For the float method, pour out half of the water in the bag. Add one half cup of aquarium water to the bag every five to 10 minutes until the bag is full. Then check the salinity level to see if it's the same as the aquarium salinity. If not, repeat this previous step until the levels match. Then there's the drip method. Carefully empty the fish into an appropriate sized bucket or container. Use your acclimation kit drip line to start a flow of aquarium water to your acclimation container. About two to four drops per second is perfect. When the water in the container or bucket doubles, pour out half the water. Let the drip line refill until the water is doubled again. Then check the salinity level to see if it's the same as the aquarium salinity. If not, repeat this previous step until the levels match. Now there are other devices out there to help you do acclimation, such as this one, which goes right inside your tank with these handy dandy little magnets that put them on there that you can use for acclimation as well. Now thanks for watching What the Fish. You can also send us questions at our customer service center at customerservice.liveaquaria.com.